What up humans, it's Noah. Today I have a speculation video for you and some other rim gameplay in the first person. This video is about guessing heroes for the upcoming DLC in Battlefront, as well as their abilities and skills. This video is only happening because of a very insightful conversation I had with Cliff G... Cliff G? CLF G Y. Yeah, something like that. One thing that I mentioned is that it's possible that Chewbacca will be a free hero and not in a DLC. And since Bosk is the exact opposite of him and is known for skinning Wookiees, it's more than possible he will be released alongside Chewbacca. Even if not free, these rivals are sure to be released together. Now on to their abilities and skills. Bosk would have a more powerful version of the Barrage which would fire 3 impact grenades. He would also be able to set up traps, which if you stepped on, would take away 80% of your health and would show where you are on the radar for 15 seconds. He would also have a special ability which would highlight his senses. It would be a heat vision ability, since I don't want to give him the same thing that Greedo has. On the other hand, Chewbacca would have a lucky shot similar to Han's and he would be able to rapid fire 5 bolts at the same time from his bowcaster. He would also have a beast mode, in which he would gain a lot of health and would do a lot of damage but only for a limited time. Now the next DLC that is coming presumably in June will include the new Bespin maps, aka Cloud City maps. As stated, Lando Calrissian is the leader of Cloud City and is sure to be the hero released in this DLC. And if he indeed is the new hero, he will probably be voiced by Billy Dee Williams, since he is known for voiceover in games and animated series. And as for the villain, all I can think about is Dengar. Not sure why, just do. Lando would also have a lucky shot and he would also have a precision shot that would last about 10 seconds, but it would be aim assist level 100, it would definitely lock onto enemies when he fires. And for the third ability, I'm thinking something about an AI ship that helps him, since he is known for being a very good pilot. I'm thinking about him summoning a storm for a twin pod cloud car, which would be controlled by AI and would fly around the air taking out enemies. Dengar would have a confidence meter similar to Greedo's, he would also have a beast mode in which he would gain a lot of health and do a lot of damage in a certain amount of time, and he would have smoke grenades. Initially, I thought about Yoda being a hero. He would be like the hero's version of the Emperor, he wouldn't have a lightsaber, just use the force. But his size and hitbox size could be a potential for disaster. And also, I'm talking about the Death Star DLC, which means that this could be a very good time to bring in old Ben. Ben would be the second hero with the lightsaber, while villains would only have one in Darth Vader. That's why he would have really weak attacks and low health, but he would have really good defense in a period time of 12 seconds, and would have abilities that would grant him even more defense. For the villain, I have honestly no idea. Maybe they come up with something original. Or maybe they use IG-88. He would have a really powerful attack, I mean, he does use a blaster rifle, but it would be really powerful. He would also have a lot of gadgets to tear down Ben's defense. At the same time, he would be really weak to lightsabers and ion shots, ion grenades, etc. He also wouldn't be affected by the Dioxys grenade, because that wouldn't make much sense. IG-88 would have a flamethrower. He would also have a DAS-430 Neural Inhibitor. It's a paralyzing dart which would paralyze a player and would kill him in 15 seconds unless a team player helps him. He would also have Dioxys grenades or scan pulse since he is a droid. His melee would be the Vibro Blade. It's a really powerful weapon and it would do a lot of damage. It would instant kill soldiers and it would do a lot of damage to heroes. Ben Kenobi would have a force bubble that he uses for defense and it would last 10 seconds. He would also have a force push and by using triangle or Y he would temporarily auto deflect blaster bolts into enemies. Ben Kenobi would also regain 1% of his health every 2 seconds. Ok humans, thank you very much for watching, let me know if you agree with me and please comment if you have any ideas on this subject, I'd love to see them. Ok, see you in the next video, farewell.